Hello, Fofamid here, and today we're going to be talking about how to do facial expressions in VR chat. So I know I did a video um, previously that you might see pop up somewhere around here on how to do that uh, with like a whole complete guide on how to do it. If you want to check it out, uh, the link should um, be here or down in the video description. But there has been a much easier way on how to do this, and I wanted to share it with you today. This video has been brought to you by Private Internet Access for fast, reliable internet browsing that allows you to appear like you're from any country in the world. Please click on the link in the video description down below. Using that link really helps this channel grow. Okay, we're going to be starting out in Unity and here you should already have your avatar brought in and have the avatar 3.0 SDK brought in. And in the SDK, you're going to go to the VR chat examples animation, and then you're going to see something called hand layer controller. So what you're going to do is press control D and you're going to duplicate it to make a copy of it. Cause this is what we're going to be using. So, um, once you make a copy of it, I like to just make it easier and rename it. So, um, I'm just going to rename it FX. And then in this case, I'm going to name it pumpkin because it's going to be for a pumpkin avatar that I'm going to have later. And then now you go back to your avatar by selecting it in the hierarchy and you go to the inspector and then you're going to see playable layers. And this is where you're going to click and drag the new, um, the new copy of the controller that we put there. So now you're going to double click the controller and you're going to see this, which is very similar. So now everything, what's really great about this is that everything is made for you. You don't really have to do any of that weird stuff on your own anymore. Now it's been made super, super simple. It's what I really love about this. So there's going to be two ways that you can get your expressions in there. So the first way is you can select each of the different hand expressions. So like fist, like hand open point and so forth. And then you can go into the motion. And then there is where you can select the animation that already came with your avatar. So here we're just going to go through and select each of the different um, hand expressions that are available for VR chat that came with this avatar or maybe ones that you've made previously. And we just have to go through one by one and then um, select for each of uh, each of the hand gestures. So in VR chat, basically um, how the animations work is you make different hand expressions. So like fist, open hand, point, piece, uh, I think, oh, can I do rock and roll, rock and roll, <laughs> handgun. And then, um, I have a really weak thumbs up on this avatar, but, and that's how you can activate different hand and facial expressions in VR chat. So here we've been setting everything for the left hand, but what's really, really cool in avatar 3.0 with new VR chat avatars is you can have different expressions for each hand. So in this case, what I'm going to do is even though I'm selecting the same emotes, for the facial expressions, you don't have to do it that way. You can select a whole new different set of emotes, but there's another way instead of having to like click through the menu, if that's not easy for you, what another way to do it is you can select, um, the hand expression again, and then in your animation folder that might've come with your avatar or ones that you've made already yourself, all you have to do is just click on the expression that you want, and then you can just click and drag it in. And that makes to me personally, I think that's the easiest way to do it, especially if you're working in an avatar project that has a lot of different um, expressions in them, or sometimes even just like a poop ton of files. Once you get all of your expressions set up, that's essentially all you have to do. So assuming that you set up everything else in uh, your avatar, and like I said, if you don't know how to do that, I do have a video guide that you should see somewhere um, that appears on the screen or in the link below. And then all you have to do is build and publish like you would normally, then open up VR chat, log in, make sure that you select your avatar. And then once you're loaded in and then here, you'll be able to see all the facial expressions working just like it would normally. And what's really nice is that when you are in VR, you'll have different set of expressions for each of your hands. If you really like this video and you wanted to see more about avatar stuff or VTuber stuff, please hit that subscribe button. That really helps this channel grow. I'm trying to push for burner. Woo! And I stream on Twitch. And if you want to chat about anything VTuber or avatar related, you can come and check me out and uh, have a great conversation. Bye bye.